These are Iraqi dinar guru updates, news, opinions, and intel dinar opinion. According to Iraqi dinar intel guru Bruce, via Weissano, what we're hearing from, what I'm going to refer to as some of our military sources, is that we should expect the notifications to be released on Friday or Saturday. According to New Sound Guru Militia Man, if the US dollar is worth less than the Iraqi dinar, there will be a black market. The dollar isn't in very high demand right now. They are in charge of it. Is the show about to start? I sincerely hope so. According to Iraqi Dinar New Sound Guru Pimpy newspaper article, oil slides to four month lows as OPEC plus deepens bearish sentiment. Where is Iraq's motivation to raise their exchange rate if oil prices keep dropping? According to New Sound, Intel Guru MNT Goat, the International Task Force, FATF, formally declared last week that Iraq had been removed off the list of high-risk countries. Yes, this is the best news yet. Thus, the writing is on the wall. The removal of Iraq off the list of nations at high risk could not come at a better time. One roadblock at a time, they are gradually removing the way for the restoration. With this in place, they were not going to return the cash to Forex. Amazing news for us today. According to Iraqi Dinar Intel Guru Frank to 6, have you seen that Kuwait and Iraq have recently connected by fiber optics? This component of the monetary reform is crucial. They are aware that the current state of the Iraqi diners' exchange rate is no longer a mystery. According to Intel Guru Marx, via PDK, referring to the post from June 14, 2024, by Mike Barr, reassessing, this seemed significant to me. I had got down with some bankers who wanted to train some individuals and go over scenarios with me and my money. And in banking at the time, they used just that phrase, it will be re-evaluated. It's reassessing. The banks refer to things in that way. They make no mention of RV or revaluation. It's reassessing. According to Iraqi Dinar guest Guru Bakayatri, Iraq is still undergoing modernization. It currently has banks and fiber optics. A good climate for doing business will be found by investors and firms with banking laws that prevent corruption and terrorism. I'm praying for this to happen in the upcoming days or sooner with blessings to accompany me. Huge ideas for ministries in an enhanced Iraq.